Rizzi, how does that feel like two points dropped? Today? Yes. Yes, because I think until 77 minutes when we concede the first goal, uh, I think was the game under control. Um, we didn't concede too many chances to a team like Arsenal, that is an amazing team that was fighting last season for for the for the trophy, and and I think this season improved with uh, some players also adding some players. And yes, I think disappointed because yes, we just I think we just. And drop to two points. Thank What do you put that down to? Is it just a, a lack of concentration? Is it a, a mistake from No, I, th I think if football can happen, this type of situation, only we need to accept. You know, today we are in an era of football that all we wanted to play, you know, from back and build from back. And now we cannot <laughs> say it was, you know, oh, and we can be uh, tough. That is football. That is the situation. Of course, mistakes mistakes can happen in football. We we, we made mistakes, a lot of mistakes, and when the players are on the pitch, they they allow to. I think we give the the possibility to make a mistake. Of course, unlucky because I think it was 77 minutes to nil, and this uh, goal I think gave the belief the belief to Arsenal. And of course, when two one, 10, 10 minutes to play or 13 um, minutes to play. Always, maybe you can concede and take risks like they were take, uh, taken. And on the end, disappointed. But in the same time, um, I am so happy because we were very competitive. Um, with all the circumstances, I think we need to feel proud about, about uh, the performance and our players. Sam, uh, Richard, good performance from Mudrich, perhaps his best ever for Chelsea. Uh, you took him off as well. Did you feel he, he was sort of running out of gas? No, I think uh, yes, he played well, but I think he needs uh, also improve. It's still not for me, it's not in his best. Uh, I think we need to change and to uh, to put a little bit more the pressure with um, with Nico Jackson in front. And I think after that uh, that situation, I think we we create few chances, and I think we were more closer. The, the game was closer to three 0 than than to one. That is the truth. After we want to talk. A different way, I don't know, but I seen, you know, I seen the chances uh, Palmer and then, uh, of course, uh, Nico. But I think we want to put a little bit pressure uh, and not to only to say okay to nil and we are going to protect the the result. But on the end, when we change, uh, we raise and Noni on the second or uh, before that we concede a few minutes before that we concede the goal. I think, you know, I seen was was unlucky, a little bit unlucky that this type of. You know, the sport and football, this situation can happen and today happen and we need to feel really sad how we feel. But in, in another way, we are very positive because we were showing great character and personality and the team, uh, was uh, per, the performance was, was really good. Well, Enrico, you've spoken about the youth of the signings in the squad. Is, is this what you get when you have young players? You get a brilliant 70 minutes and then one mistake and... Change the game. Yeah, what's happening in all the in all the teams? You know, that can happen. Uh, too many too many games that we are watching every every week, you know, and always mistakes, always mistake, always mistake. Because football is about to mistake. If you want to score, you need that some you know the opponent made a mistake. If not, you know, I think ninety percent of the goals is because the opponent made a mistake when you score and when you know and when. You, uh, they score the same because football is about to to make a mistake. I think only what we can criticize a little a, li a little bit that is to read better the situation. No, in football, the tempo, the timing, 77 minutes sometimes to take some risk. Okay, we can because it's our philosophy, but maybe to better decision. But that happened in football. No, maybe we can criticize a little bit this situation, but uh, also is. It's football and this situation can happen. Do you mean 77 minutes to nil up is not necessary to maybe play out from the back? You can just go long or...? Yes, exactly. Or to find different options to play. But it's not to blame someone. It's only that this type of situation maybe you need to to read better, you know. Um, yes, that happened. That is, is going to arrive with, with time. All the winner uh, uh, teams always is. Is, is to to manage and to drive the the games um, what you want and to read situation when you need to be calm when to play when to take risks but 
this type of thing will arrive with time and we are still really young team and we are knowing each other and still not all the squad uh, ready to compete for their place. I think we are in a good momentum, we need to keep this momentum after the, the three victories uh, um, in the before the international break, but I think we need to keep going. Um, we really believe that we can do something good uh, until um, in the future. Okay, we're going to do two more, and then we're going to do a Mondays here, and then Neil to finish. What, what did you make of Kukurena's game? He was even pushing forward, like pushing, and then, yeah, are you, I, I guess you, based on today, you will definitely like to keep him, as there were reports that he was maybe leaving, but what do you make of his game today? No, I think it's a natural process. Um, it's, it's so clear that uh, when we arrived here three months ago, uh, some players were uh, in a position that maybe stay or maybe go. I, I didn't know the pass. Only I can, you know, to choose the player that uh, we believe that can perform. And Mark, uh, he and the club decide to stay uh, in the last transfer window. And of course, he's training really well. That is why he's playing like today, playing really well. Again, a very good uh, player like Saka. Yes, but that is, is him. You know, is he deserves the credit because in the last few months, he's working really, really hard. He was able to play on the right side, you know. Um, yes, in this way, he, uh, only, only uh, uh, what can happen is that the team is going to be better and better. Okay, last one in this section, just one please, Neil. You changed the shape of the team and push Gallagher further forward. Was that more to do with not having a fit centre forward or more to do with wanting to stop them playing out through short to be, To be honest, uh, was both, you know, uh, Brocha wasn't available. And then to decide to play with Nico after his surgery in his um, arm, wrist. Arm, yeah. wrist. Uh, yes, is to find different way to try to you know to to play in keeping our principle. But I think yes, to 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 change a little bit the shape and the strategy how we, we need to attack. Um, yes, was a little bit both. Um, yes, I think so happy with the performance of him and, and Palmer. They they were they were very good. Okay, last quick one here, Jerry. Can I just get your thoughts on Sir Bobby Charlton? Sam? Yes, I am really sad. I think I want to send my best wishes to the family. And uh, yes, I think it was a big impact when we received the, the new. Um, we lose a, an amazing person. Uh, he was one of the greatest players in the world. And yes, we are we are going to miss miss him because he was an icon for for our love of the sport, no, for football. Thank you very much. Thank you. Thank you.